We all know that software industries are changing day by day and adopting new technologies. And it is really hard to stand out in a crowd where you have a high competition. Then how we will get a job in 2024? Well, I'm going to share these five skills which will help you to get the high paying job as a programmer. And the last skills in my list is bonus skills. So that is very important. So do not skip and watch till the end. The first skill is cloud computing. One of the most demanding skills in software industries now study is cloud computing. And almost 90% of the companies are already moved to the cloud. Now, what is cloud computing? Cloud computing helps you to deploy and create and even manage their application without the need of the physical infrastructure. Most of the popular cloud providers are AWS, Microsoft Azure, and GCP, which is Google Cloud Provider. And if you want to learn, then there are a lot of videos already uploaded on YouTube channel. You can go over there and you can watch it. The second skills is learning Git and GitHub. So Git is a version controller program. It is an open source program. It is a tool. You can say that. And GitHub is a company that help you to collaborate with other developers, programmers or other contributors in the platform. And you can host your code with the help of Git. So they are using a Git program which is open source and github is a company which provides a free accounts and also some premium subscriptions so you can go there you can create your account and you can practice on it and i can give you the simple example for understanding about the git so suppose you have created an application for your client and you have added a new feature but your client doesn't like it and he wants the previous version of the application well how we can do that? If you're using a get, it is very easy. We're running just one command. You can roll back to the previous version. So get will create a new version for each and every code which you are saving it. And that will help you to roll back easily. So learning it and GitHub will help you to get a job easily. All right. The third skills in our list is Docker. Docker is really changing the software development life cycle. And to understand about the Docker, you need to understand about the containerization. Let me give you the simple example. Suppose you have built a program in Python language with some third party libraries in the development environment and you have tested also everything looks like fine and you are ready to go to deploy in the production environment. But when you try to deploy in the production environment, it doesn't work. There are a lot of reasons it can be a Python is not installed or maybe the third party libraries that you're using in the development environment might be not installed in the production environment or some kind of compatibility issues also. So Docker's is helping these kind of issues in the production environment and helping developers and operations team so that they don't get any compatibility issue. So what is Docker? Docker is a company that provides a containers and it is open source that help you to deploy application without any hassle. So it helps you to create isolated containers which, which have everything that you need it, like including the libraries, systems, tools, code, everything, and it create a package kind of things. And you can deploy a Docker package to anywhere without getting any issues. And when you will start learning Docker, you will understand managing Docker is important than creating it. So here is the most popular tool in the market is Kubernetes. This is a fourth skill that you should have to learn in 2024. Kubernetes is help to manage any containers, not only the Docker, but it is compatible with any containers. That's why Kubernetes is one of the most popular tool in the market. And I can give you the simple example how Kubernetes work. Suppose you are watching Netflix without any trouble, right? And not only you, but millions of people are watching Netflix on the same time. But do you ever see that Netflix server goes down because of high traffic? No, right? Because they are using Docker containers to run millions of applications every week to giving the better experience to the user. But when the traffic goes down, they reduce the containers, which will help in cost cutting. And how this is possible? They are using container management tool. They are using their own tool, but Kubernetes is very popular and used by many of the high level companies like Google and other companies. So learning Kubernetes is essential in 2024. Now, the last but not least is OWASP top 10. As I said in the beginning, coding is not enough. You need to learn how to write a secure code. And learning from OWASP will help you to get a high paying job in 2024. 
So what is OWASP? OWASP is Open Web Application Security Programs and it is not a tool, it is an open source communities that improve the security of softwares and that help millions of software companies to write a secure code. And they are releasing top 10 vulnerabilities that is impacting the businesses and that will also help you when you start writing a code. Suppose you are writing a JavaScript code, so you can learn how to sanitize it with the cross-site scripting attacks. So you can visit on their official website, you can read the documentations and there are also a list of open source security tools that you can use it and you can also add in your resume that will help you to get a job also. And I will give you the link in the description so you don't have to worry about that. And if you add these five skills in 2024, I will promise you will get a high paying job in your dream companies. But make sure you are learning from these tools. You need to create a portfolio. You need to create a projects that you can show them in your resume. Also share your knowledge on LinkedIn that will help you to communicate with other people. If this video is useful, please don't forget to subscribe, like and hit the bell icon and see you in the next video.